So this video was only going to be a Mario and Rabbids trailer reaction if there was one in the Ubisoft conference, but there was so much that I had to say and react to and just laugh at when it comes to this press conference that I decided to make an entire video out of it. So without any further ado, here is my reactions to the Ubisoft forward. But I know why y'all are here. We got you this gorgeous this. green so screen. The Rainbow Six operators are facing. Yes, we're here for Rainbow Six. Deadly threat. If it fell. Wow. <laughs> I want Raymond, Raven, and Rabbits four. If there's a way to stop them, you will find it. Ah, uh, Ubisoft, listen to me, all right? This is what we need. We need the sequel, all right? We need the sequel to this. Or we need the third part to this, or fourth part. Fuck, I have three in my hand. We need the fourth part of this, or the second part of this. That's what I'm here for. Show it to me. Three-player co-op experience. You might think you know what you're getting into since there's going to be some of your I know there's Rainbow people who are excited for this. I get that. This time, you're not Give us a trailer of the thing itself. And if you want to explain how it's going to work so and all the special gadgets, little things, you do it at a later as you progress time. The game, you'll unlock new ability upgrades and you don't do it during E3. So the operators we just saw we're here to watch really trailers cool. we're here well, to learn to new bottom? things she got captured we're not here to watch you explain shit to us for 10 minutes if you are a teammate for joining me i'm really my god's over of the details we still have literally 10 out. minutes yes that's right yeah extraction will bring everyone together we don't want six things life. 10 minutes each we want 60 things one minute each exclusive unlocks for you in both games okay You've been waiting long enough. Let's take an exclusive first look at some gameplay footage. Here is Rainbow Six Extraction. Really? 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 Welcome to Rainbow You're Six You're still not done. The new tactical co-op shooter game where Rainbow Six operators are dropped into alien territory. To investigate anomalies can you imagine if they did this on an E3 stage? Honestly, legitimately, can you imagine if they did this on an E3 stage? Or if somebody like Nintendo in like a Nintendo Direct did this exact same thing, where they not only announced something, talked about it for five minutes afterwards, and then proceeded to show gameplay for it for about five minutes after that. Usually, Nintendo will show off a game for three to five minutes, and that's considered long. Usually, you'll see a game on any of their uh, expos for three to five minutes, and that's considered long. It has been 10 minutes, and it's still going. Why? It's a rooter. Guys, it's a rooter. If this is your way to make me want to play Rainbow Six Siege again, this ain't the way to go about it. I don't want to see a 15 minute fucking presentation on a single mode. And I may seem like a Nintendo fanboy, because I am. But let me tell you this, when Sakurai was talking about the spirits mode, I got bored from that too. Because he went on for 10 fucking minutes about spirits. I didn't care. So, I can be unbiased. This is boring. Please stop. You could have easily just made this 30 minutes. And just left all this shit out until you wanted to talk about it specifically in some other thing. And even then, this isn't the way to go about it. Do you need help, Ubisoft? Do you need help? Is somebody keeping you hostage, Ubisoft? Blink once for yes, blink twice for no. This is just a fucking Rainbow Six Siege direct. That's all this is. 
It has now been 15 minutes. It is still going. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, looking at um, the cover and the back cover for this is more exciting than whatever the fuck's going on over there. Is it over? Is it over? Operators, it's time to unite and stand together against this emerging threat. Squad up with friends over. and go up or it's step over. into containment alone. Stay now for the next 15 minute thing. Now, shut up. Very soon. I got one of them guitars around here somewhere. It's broken, but I got one of them guitars. Hold on, let me see if I can find my guitar. I haven't used it in a while. I got one of them guitars. It's a little dusty. Got a few cobwebs. I got one of them guitars too. <coughs> Hell yeah. The fuck was that one? Oh yeah, listen to that. Metal subgenres. Can I play all star? From all over the world, from big stars to indie. Bring it back out. It's the Bring most up. diverse. All star. Good to came on. Yeah. Avaganza. Since then, the project's grown by jumps and grinds. So is literally every game in here going to be like a five to ten minute explanation of how the game is actually played they're gonna do this for all these games and then if that rumor is true that we're getting another mario and rabbits game that one that's gonna be the game that gets like a minute trailer and then that's it okay so we've seen some of our favorite rainbow six operators battling <laughs> alien parasites but how's their day job going? You know, ever since Crimson Heist, we're still trying to clear all those pesky Flores drones off the maps. Year six to a blazing start with Siege passing 200,000 concurrent players no. a few weeks ago. No, you're it's not going back to Siege. You've already talked about it for 15 fucking minutes. Stop. Stop. You're not going back. Wanna get hit? And for console players, in and honestly, you know what? Even if the first part wasn't Rainbow Six Siege, particularly because of some solo solo player shit, we've already talked for 15 minutes about Rainbow Six. Doesn't matter if it's Siege or not. Shut up. Why? Just Dance has always been about connecting with friends and family. That's not why. There are no bad dancers. So move the coffee table, alert the local homeowners association. I don't got a coffee table. I got a desk. That's all I got. Hundred million raids in total. Don't care and about don't statistics. In your settlements. Congrats. Who cares? Igor still has a long journey ahead. I'm sitting here like, oh my god, we did 300 million raids? Who cares? Ubisoft. New no one cares. Whole new game modes, such as the river raids update. And the map if you want to talk about the game, that's fine. I have no problem with that. Until you get to 15 minutes, then I have a problem with it. But who cares? How many raids we did? Or how many executions we did? Or how many times we pressed A? No one cares. So you've seen some great games from us. But we also have news about the movies and TV series we've been working on. Our Ubisoft film and television team has some exclusive content to share. E3. First is Video games. All right. Ubisoft. The if you oh, haven't watched the second season game yet, here's a look is, uh, at what you've been missing before the upcoming season We finale. don't care about TV. We don't care about movies. We don't care. Why do you have goosebumps? This is an involuntary reaction to being inspired. I was emotionally manipulated. What's the difference? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
And I'm Sam Richardson, the star of Werewolves Within. Werewolves Within was based off a Ubisoft game. We're so excited to bring you an exclusive look just for you. Check it out. Yes, I am having fun. Dr. I don't know whatever the fuck's going on in that screen. We're so excited for you all to check out this next game. Oof, Neelam, I can't wait to get my hands on this one. Is it time? It's blood time! Okay, <laughs> I'm ready now. Show me the blahs. It's Mario, we're getting number two. We are now our oh, I see Rabbit Peach back there. <laughs> Gotta take them selfies. They're putting Rosalina in. I see Luma. I, as soon as I see Luma, I think Rosalina. They got a Luma. Nope, that's cursed. Nope, it's over. It's over. Stop. Nope. Mm. Nope. Stop. Bad touch. Bad touch. A fucking rabid Luma. Why? Why? Why are you doing this to us? Oh, that's a hit. No, we don't like that. We're going in. Oh, they're dead. <laughs> they're dead. It's time to go in on an intergalactic fucking adventure with our rabbits. Oh boy, here we go. I just want to see Rosalina. Why is that one on fire? That's not what I meant. <laughs> don't make it seem like you don't want her that much. My God. I don't remember Rosalina being that fucking bored out of her own life. <laughs> She's like, whatever. If I have to. Who that? Is that Boozer? Rabid Boozer? Oh, we got a ba bomb. Who the fuck are you, Magic Koopa? That's Rabbit Boozer, yet yeah, she looks so just done with life. And now for Rosalina to actually come in. Or did they take over Rosalina? I don't fucking know. Hit <laughs> the umbrella. Where's Rabbit Luigi? Where did he go? Where's Rabbit Mario? Sparks of Hope? Yeah, that leak was absolutely correct. On the name and everything, because it had DDLC in it too, and that came out yesterday. We We're probably going to get an actual trailer or gameplay trailer in a, in a Nintendo's E3. Or we're just going to get it right now. Never mind. We're just going to get it right the fuck now. I still prefer you not talking about it and just showing us. Like I said earlier, just show us. Don't talk about it. That's all. Wait a minute. That's... Isn't that Bowser Shuri like tower kind of thing? I don't know, like that kind of reminded me of that. Also, hey, Bima, how you doing? There's Rabbit Luigi, he's here. And Rabbit... Atlanta, Atlantis man. So is this more of, ooh. More free roaming. Is this more free roaming? That's actually cool. I like that. Uh -huh. What the fuck are you? What the fuck? Use the fire element.
All right. Probably, yeah. I was going to say it's either holiday or 2022. What? Enjoy. Beautiful but dangerous. Beautiful but dangerous. I see fucking Pikachu run across the screen. Pika! What the fuck? Avatar? I saw a blue guy. I haven't seen Avatar, alright? In probably more than a decade. But I can spot the, an Avatar guy, as in a blue guy, from a mile fucking away. You know what? Here. Because I'm assuming it's ending. Rainbow Six stuff. Boring. Boring. The the racing kind of game? No, that looked kind of interesting. Far Cry? That looked good. Rabbits? That looked pretty good. The Avatar? Doesn't fucking make sense in the year 2021, 2022. But you know, it looked fine. But they definitely, uh... Stalled to make sure we got to that one hour mark. They really did a lot of that. In Rainbow Six Today, we could have made this presentation about 20 to 30 minutes. But by golly, we had to make it fucking an hour. There may be more in the post show, but this is where I'm ending it. 